Hi, I'm Dr. Daniel Miller. I'm a board certified chiropractic neurologist, and today I'm going to show you VOR cancellation exercise number one. VOR stands for your vestibular ocular reflex, and it's a key and integral part of your vestibular systems so that your head, as it moves through space, your eyes are able to stay focused on a given area and you'll be able to continue to move through space or stay within space without having any dizziness or disequilibrium. So in many cases, such as with anxiety or with uh, different mental illness, or if you have a lot of arthritis in your neck, have had fusion surgery, have conditions such as Parkinson's, Huntington's chorea, vestibular ocular reflexes are oftentimes diminished, whether it, it be from a pathology or whether it, it's from uh, arthritis or a traumatic event. In any event, we're going to show you the vestibular ocular reflex uh, cancellation exercise to help improve on those uh, abilities. And so here we go. I'm going to take off my glasses and what you're going to do is you're going to sit or stand. You're going to hold your finger 30 degrees below your nose and about 14 to 18 inches away from your face. Let me just move back here to make sure it's being shown. You are going to focus on your finger. Your eyes are going to remain focused on your finger at all times. And you're going to begin to turn your head from left to right. Now, you may find that you have difficulty seeing your finger it may become blurred not because you don't have your glasses on but it may appear as two if you see two fingers here where there's only one you want to move back to the area where there's just one finger now the goal of the exercise is not only to do it for time such as this back and forth going for a minute but also at the fastest rate of left to right or right to left motion as possible. So be like this. And now what you want to do is try to do it as fast as you can while maintaining focus on the tip of your finger here. If in doing this as fast as you can, you're looking all around, if that's not the ocular reflex remediation. So what you want to do as fast as you can while staying focused. You want to do it up to one minute. Now that was covering our horizontal planes. You then want to turn your finger so it is horizontal or perpendicular to where it was before. Again, 30 degrees below our nose, about 14 to 18 inches. Looking at it, and you want to come up so that your eyes are coming down now. Looking down so your eyes are coming up now. And you want to go like this, back and forth as fast as you can so that you are able to stay focused on the proceeding. Should you start to have tearing, your eyes fatigue, or you're unable to stay focused on your finger any longer, then you want to cease your recent metabolic fatigue. So, so the goal of the exercise is one minute. You may only be able to do this for 10 seconds. I was turning my head in this area. You may only be able to do it from here to here. And that is fine. We have to start wherever we are at. So if by going like this things get real blurry or it hurts and you can't do it, but you can go from here. This is where we're going to start the remediation exercise. And by doing so, we're going to rely on the theory of neuroplasticity in order to help the brain re-strengthen itself so that we can get greater range while being able to comfortably maintain looking at our finger. So give those a try. Again, you want to do them for about one minute if you can, but you start wherever you're at. You will cease doing them once your eyes start to hurt. You're unable to stay looking at your finger or you start to have tearing or increased sweating also, any autonomic symptom. If you have any questions, give me a call at 607-729-0591, or you can email me at 
through www.naturallywell.us and click on the contact button. I hope this does you well. Be well and have a great day.